Hello, everybody. Happy Thursday. Happy update. Well, it's the day after the update for you guys. For me, it's update day. Why won't my chapstick work? Come on. There we go. Cubby's here. Cubby's here. How is everybody doing? Do you guys like this update? Are you enjoying it so far? I haven't looked through all of the news yet, so I don't really know exactly what we're getting this week. I have some ideas, but yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I'm hoping we're going to have a little bit more to do every week, every day. Some more XP. I've got some more crusties to level. I'm nearing the end of my Gen 1s and 1.5s, 1 1. so I'm nearing the end. I have most of them almost to 15 sort of i think i still have like six or seven so almost enough time in the festival i think that i can get them all done but today we're here on snowdrop to check out the new stuff they've added today just a heads up this recording may get interrupted because my sister-in-law just went to the hospital she thinks that she her water is breaking she's not sure yeah her pregnancy has been quite a journey so far but this week is supposed to be the week so i may be like all of a sudden just be like oh my god i'll be back later editing me will take care of it but if i'm sure i'll say something if there's a jump but just adds up that yeah that is happening hopefully i will still be able to get this video out on time only future me and you know if this video makes it out tomorrow it's been quite a week and i have a lot going on today because of that the whole like potential nephew showing up as of a vet appointment and usually i go to bingo on wednesdays but i don't know if bingo is gonna happen unfortunately but hopefully at least this video can happen um sorry that was a very long intro but <laughs> there's a lot going on today and a lot going on in my mind it's early for me it's not even 10 a.m if you know me you know that that is obscenely early for me i've just been awake since about 6 30 and i was like you know what i'm not gonna try to sleep anymore i'm just gonna get up and get working because of how busy i am i might as well get this done earlier in the day just to you know try to solidify the fact that it will actually happen am I, are my words making any sense i'm not really sure but okay let's swap over and take a look at the update notes let's go see what's going on there we go it's sabine's challenge this week hey star fam your regions far and wide have come to participate in the equestrian festival but there are two in particular you need to impress okay so We've got the rise to Sabine's challenge. Uh, hold on to your saddles because Sabine just unleashed a whole new, even more challenging course in Moreland. I have seen people talking on Reddit about how hard this is. They're like, how are kids supposed to be doing this? So I'm afraid. I'm riding a lower level horse, but I did give it a bunch of cookies. So she should be at least moving at the higher speed. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> So then the Baroness is here. She's going to award us with the ultimate prize, the prestigious ribbon and a fancy pet cat. I'm so excited for that fancy pet cat. He looks just like my old kitty cat that I had. So excited. They did lower the requirements this year. Last year it was like 80 and or something. This year it's only 40. So if you've been playing like I've been playing, you've been done with that requirement just a couple days into the event which is cool it means i can really easily get it on other accounts of mine then they brought back the red string trail which if you've been playing before you know what it is it's just kind of a little what is it like a trail ride yeah a red string trail ride <laughs> that you talk to the car that's in the background here and they'll take you over to the fur grove area you ride up the trail sometimes you see things and you get to the top and you tie your string up it's really cute and i see a lot of people doing it as like groups it sounds adorable uh, and then scott buttergood's here with herding his animals always fun may you have no four cow days fun fact this is how i learned that herding was even a thing in the game because it broke last year hopefully it doesn't break this year last year you couldn't do the animals you had to like push they wouldn't move so you had to like keep reloading, hoping you got donkeys and horses or do yeah, donkeys and foals. I, that's when I found out that you could actually do it at Starshine every day. I'd been playing for months at that time and I had no idea that Starshine had daily herding. <laughs> so that's how I learned uh, that that was a thing. But hopefully it's not broken and hopefully we get as few four cow or four sheep days as possible. Those are the worst days. Okay, they've given a little makeover to the horse trainer and the riding club grandmaster. Brand new look and updated UI. I'll have to pop on by and see them. They're slowly removing the stay overnight feature. Okay, you won't need to pay a star coin fee or wait a day to continue playing time locked quests. Okay, they've been doing this for a little bit. 
they've been removing the whole like come back tomorrow or pay thing from quests so i'm interested to see like how th what that does i might try to do some stuff on my fiance's account just to see like where they've kind of removed them because there are a lot of parts of the story specifically where it's like do one quest come back tomorrow or whatever so we'll see we'll see testing a new button that only select players will be able to see that's the horse shot button. I feel like a lot of people have this button if Reddit is anything to go off of. I haven't checked. I kind of forgot it was a thing. I haven't checked to see if I've got it. And then the daily races at Yorvik Stables are now replayable. I wonder what races those are. Is it all the races over there? Because I think there's like three that are specific to that area. Or is it just the two that are like that one girl gives them? All right. And then next week, we've got a new dressage routine, the loop-de-loop -loop routine. Okay and enjoy the spirit of competition. I don't really know what that means here. So, okay, we've got a lot this year or this week, but the newest things are these two top things. The strail, strail, the string trail and the herding are, you know, they're here every year for the festival, but we will take a look at everything and see how it's going. All right, snowdrop, let's see what's going on here. I don't even really know where to like start. So I've got this bouncy quest. It looks like all the races over here the, all three of them are replayable because they've lost their like daily race marker. I think if I turned on purple quests, there we go. Yeah. Oh, there's like three replayable races over here. I must be forgetting about something that exists. But because I never have this on, I forget, especially like these, the fir grove races, I forget they exist. Okay, so there's three races that are replayable, at least three. I'm trying to remember like what this one is all right so let's just take a look it looks like the only bouncy yellow quest is over here scott's wandering animals okay there has to be another sabine quest somewhere let's just get these going oh i should see if they added any more tack while i'm here i feel like if they did they would have added another horse yeah it's the same stuff on this one i can't remember if there's any sets that we aren't seeing yet I do have to just come over here and buy all this stuff at some point that I haven't bought yet. All right, let's go to the Red String Trail. Yeah, you just take that car. Oh, Sabine's up there. She's looking threatening. So he's got like four animals that you have to go hunt down. I don't know if I necessarily want to do them right now. No, actually, I'm not going to do them right now. I don't want to waste my time on some things i've already done let's talk to sabine and see what this whole thing is about because this is new new all right sabine is there something you want why are you sitting here menacingly with a bunch of trash you look nervous house cat and puppy dog don't act like you don't know me wow rude oh i gotta try her course oh we got our boots finally I know that it, people have known that we're getting her boots. They've been like data mined, but I don't really watch a lot of those gear data mine things because I don't really care. All right, let's see. Again, I've heard this is really difficult. Ooh, it's got the good music at least. The sky is darkening. Oh, okay, we've got to avoid. Oh my God, lightning. How am I supposed to avoid the lightning? Oh, okay. More lightning. A car. Dude, the lightning is so... startling. <laughs> How do you tell when the lightning is gonna happen? Oh, okay. Oh my god. I tried to jump it, but that did not work. Okay, that was not as hard as I thought it was going to be. It wasn't as hard as I th people were making it sound. I could definitely see that being really difficult if you're on mobile. But on PC, like, that was... Not that difficult. All right, so then you can do it again. Let's do it one more time. 
I need the lightning to wake me up. Oh my gosh. Oh. Okay, so they just push you at least. Wait, I have to go up. Start over. I spoke too soon. Is this a different route? Or am I just like, I'm not forgetting it. This is a different route. Okay, that was different. I'm confused. Does it change? Like, does it get- is it different, like, every time? What? I'm so confused by that, but okay. We have the full Sabine gear set. Not the tack set, but the gear set. I wish we'd gotten the tack set, but I don't think we've gotten that yet. So then the other thing... Oh, hang on. Let me talk to the championship schedule. Oh my gosh, 2.59. Port Pinta. Take me to Port Pinta. Oh my god, there's just so much like talking in a lot of these quests. I'm just like, just take me where I need to go. That was my alarm to wake up, so that's how early I am. I feel like I'm gonna show up like just a second too late. Oh my god, I made it. Cannot believe I made it for this. Let's see. Are you okay? You don't look okay. What? what is happening to our stylus here? She's not doing very well. So it was the club menu and the XP person. We're getting updates. So I'll have to take a look at them. Just me and three other people here. <laughs> but I'm riding a baby horse. I'm not here to win. I'm just here to get the dailies done. All right, now we have to go see the Baroness. What is this? Is this the club person? Yeah, the riding club grandmaster. All right, she's cute. I like her outfit. Let's go see what the Baroness is up to. So those three are redoable. I mean, one of those is dressage learning. So that's what one of the jumpy purple quests is. Okay, so all right, the Baroness is impressed. A ribbon to remember. An important announcement, kitty cat, Sir Meowstash, majestic feline, sleek as a tuxedo. All right, let's go. Well, she's on her way. Glad they didn't make us wait to watch her walk the whole way. That would have taken a long time at that pace. It's me. Okay, now the butler needs an, a bit of an update. <laughs> Yay, I did it. Let's put the ribbon on and the kitty in the bag. He's so cute. Oh, look at him. Oh, his little feet are in the dirt. Oh my god, hello. Come with me, kitty. Can we get somewhere that... Oh, look at him. Hopefully we're better over here. He's so cute. Stretching. I wish I was looking down. It would look kind of like I was petting him. Instead, it looks like I'm kind of creepily trying to grab his head. Oh, I forgot there was like a bug that going into camera mode might crash you. So that's fun. Pray for me that I, while I do this. I just want to see the cutie kitty cat. Look at his little bow tie. Whoa, that was really close all of a sudden. I like the music that's playing right now. Hopefully it's loud enough for people to like hear it. Oh my god, we're up close and personal. Amazing. Okay, is that everything? Oh, okay. Oh, right. I wanted to look at the... Who was it? It was the club person. And then the leveling person. 
trying to oh they're right here the horse trainer got an update they got the pink pigtails okay okay so this is a new ui it looks different that's for sure cool they're just slowly updating people oh there's the new ribbon it's a very nice ribbon maybe i should hide myself hide me i look pathetic Dude, the bridal is looking ridiculous. Why you gotta be like that, bridal? Oh, I got my special movements now. I know they can't do it, but it would be kind of cool if there was like a dressage routine that required you to do a special movement, but I know that not all horses have them and not all of them work like the same. You're gonna be in here bunny hopping on yourself, Francais. But they have that like tolt only race so that exists i don't know if there was anything else this week that i was like i need to go look at that i need to see if i got the horse shop button i don't think i got it because i think i've seen it. it's down here so i didn't get the horse shop button but it looks just kind of like you know the shop but for horses if you can believe it all right, let's just check to see what animals I have to herd today. Let's just get it out of the way. Okay, I've got a sheep down there. I don't really want to do that one right now. Oh, no, I got a cow, too. Got a sheep and a cow. Oh, no, another sheep. Ugh, okay, I got one donkey. Thank God for that, at least. It's not four. I wish the animals were as varied here as they are, or I wish they were as varied at the actual ranch as they are during these quests. Okay, this sucks. Because it's always just the black and white cows and the white sheeps. But on this quest you can get the brown cows, there's black sheeps, even the donkey, like the donkeys are always white in the other one. I don't know if the foals have any variation because it's been so long, but they're always gray. That star shine. I keep thinking I have like a Bridgerton soundtrack playing, but it's the in-game festival music. Dude, I thought my donkey was lapping me for a second there. The light pole gets all of us at least once. Alright, let's go get the other two. Well, I'm doing one at a time. I've made the mistake before of trying to hurt two. Mm, no, I think not. I think not. Let's get this sheep. Even this sheep is like different than the other ones that you get at the ranch. I'm gonna swap back to Soft Soul, the Gen 1 Frisian I'm leveling, and it's gonna have so much XP waiting for them. It's gonna be amazing. How are your guys' festivals going? Are you doing a lot of leveling? I'm trying so hard to get all of my like Gen 1s and Gen 1 and a halfs leveled during this i know that i'm probably gonna acquire some more after the festival because of the what is it the andalusians retirement i think it's the andalusians they look just like the frisians and honestly i i like that model i think it's still it's still kind of fun to ride it so i will probably be getting at least one if not all of them depending on finances at the time and also there's been some like data mined new coat colors i know i said earlier i don't watch the data mines for tack because i don't really care but for coat colors and breeds yes i do care um i'm not gonna show it here in this video but it's on the sso spoilers instagram there's like a new data mined or spoilers coat for a cell francais it's like a black pinto it's so cute then there's also a new arden I don't know what the coat is called and it doesn't look like it's finished quite yet. The feet are a bit off colored in my opinion. Okay, I was getting a family update during that cow herding. Um, what was I saying? Oh, I was talking about the Arden coat. I don't know what it is, but it doesn't look quite finished. But there is a new Mustang coat as well that's been data mined that is super cute. I'm excited for that one, but I love the Mustangs. I'm only missing two Mustangs right now. And I'm trying to tell myself to just wait for them to go on sale. Don't buy them. Wait for them to go on sale. But uh, I don't know when we're going to see those coats come into game. I don't know. The only one I'm like, I need it is the Mustang. The other two, I could take it or leave it. Like the Cell Francais. I really want a second Cell Francais, but I can wait. 
Okay, so we got the red string trail. All right, here we go. We're on the red string trail. I feel like this would be really good on the South France because they have that like cross country uphill gate vibe instead of on my dressage horse. But yeah, the new coats that are being spoilered are really cute. Don't know when we're going to get them though. Like, I wonder if they're going to start, if the Western Festival becomes such a big thing, I wonder if they would start doing like exclusive coats for that festival, you know, like they do for this equestrian festival. I wonder if they would think about doing it for the Western Festival because I think it's one of the only festivals right now that doesn't have like horse releases with it. If that makes sense. They did release new coats last year during it. Because I remember during the survey they were like, what did you, did you buy any of the festival horses? And I was like, what are you talking about? What festival horses? And then I remember they released new coats. But they didn't feel like western-y to me. Because I think it was like new the new Belgian Warmbloods and something else. And I was like, what do you mean new festival specific coats? So I wonder if they're going to do the same thing this year with these three new coats. If they're going to just be like, during the Western Festival, we release new coat colors for certain breeds. They don't have to be Western breeds, though. <laughs> like, okay. Very weird. I don't, I don't know. I, how do you guys feel about that? Do you think that's a little bit weird? I'm just taking my time. I guess I could hurry it up, but why? You know, what am I in a hurry for? Actually, I do have things to hurry for. I do have things to hurry for. I have to tell I have to tell my mom some stuff that before I forget, which I will forget. There was two things I needed to tell her. I only remember one. Also, guys, like, oh my god, planning a wedding is so stressful. <laughs> Zero out of ten would not recommend. I was seriously like looking at the costs for wedding planners, and I I was like, it might be worth it. It might be worth it. Except that I'm already like oh, I'm so close to being done with getting everything planned oh my god it's so stressful i'm just ready for it to be done and i still have months to go not even counting the visa process my fiance had his medical if you don't know how like the visa process works for like a fiance visa which is when you're engaged to somebody and you're trying to get them a visa to come to get married and then you apply to become like a citizen through that marriage while you're on the fiance visa there's a whole lot of stuff in the process but the step that we're at is he had to go take like a medical exam and get like shots and things like that and they mailed him the forms and it was supposed to be overnighted all right so the forms are supposed to be overnighted right so they're supposed to spend like one night where's my red string did i do this wrong I think I had to instigate it. Oh my god, you guys, I'm so stupid. Uh, let me go back down. Don't forget to instigate the trail, you guys. I thought you could just ride it once you get the quest. I'm stupid. Okay. Anyways, he got his medical done and they mail him the forms because the medical is done in a specific... Is it called a state in Australia? I don't even know. They're done in Sydney and he doesn't live in Sydney. So they had to mail him the forms when they were done. And again, I will repeat, this was overnighted. It was only supposed to be like t one to two days in the mail, right? Unfortunately, they overnighted it over a weekend. So it extended it. During that time, there was a flood, like a flash flood kind of thing, I think, in the Sydney area and his package was just sitting for days we were like maybe it was because of the flood like maybe that's why it's not moving um no it was because the truck that the forms were in the singular mail truck somehow in the middle of a flash flood caught fire and everything burnt up like this one mail truck on fire done gone like this singular truck in the middle of a flood so in the middle of like torrential downpours there we go don't be like me start the trail before you start the trail yeah so in the middle of torrential downpours somehow this one truck catches on fire luckily we, we were doing this all early there's still weeks before he like actually needs the forms he's like what if i have to go back to sydney and i'm like you cannot tell me they do not have a protocol in place and he's like what for a, an act of god setting fire to the truck i'm like 
No, but there's got to be other people have. To... This is not the first time somebody has needed the forms again, like whether it's lost in the mail or whatever. Oh my gosh, it's just been like such a crazy week on top of like that and some dog problems like and this whole like my nephew. Oh my God, he's just cute. Oh, hello, Z. Um, it's just been a crazy week. Whew. Man, am I going to leave all this rambling in this video? I'm just, you know, going with the flow. There we go. I did it right this time, you guys. Don't forget to start the trail. You actually have to do that. Take us back to... Thank you. Ugh. Okay, I think that was everything. And I have just been talking at you guys about real life stuff. Luckily, I did it at the end of the video during the red string trail. So anybody who didn't care already got to see like the new stuff that they maybe cared about. And anybody who just wanted to hear me talk about random life things, there you go. At some point I probably will do just like a chat and train video, but it'll be during a quieter week when I don't have as maybe as many things going on and the game doesn't have as many things going on. So we'll see maybe next week if it's just a dressage. I had to change my character's body shape because I couldn't handle the swole arms. So rip to my star coins, but I think I'll be close enough that I'll only have to spend a couple dollars. And now I'm like on the fence. This is a huge subject change, guys, by the way. I'm on the fence. Should I get the chestnut Arabian or should I get one of the thoroughbreds? I'm leaning towards the chestnut Arabian just because I love the Arabians, but I don't have a thoroughbred yet. So I'm like, I don't know which one to go in on. I like the, the flea bitten one is cute, but I, I think I like the flea bitten cell francais more. So I'm like, well, maybe I should just get the flea bit in sell francais. But it's either the chestnut Arabian or one of the thoroughbreds. So if you have an opinion, put it in the comments below which one you think I should get. The These guys are a little bit cheaper than the Arabians, so there's that. Let me know. Give me your opinions. I think the Arabian is one of the best Gen 3 breeds they've ever done. It's like, as somebody who used to ride and do... I was learning how to, like, train horses on Arabians. I love the arabians in this game so much but let me know okay i don't know i'm on the i'm on the fence i think i'm gonna end up with this one but let me know what you think okay put it in the comments should i get the arabian or should i get the thoroughbreds i love them both i don't but i don't know what to pick so let me know thank you guys so much for hanging out i'm sorry that this I, i'm not sorry you know what i'm not sorry this devolved at the end into chatting it is what it is this is my channel if i want to chat i will chat so thank you guys for hanging out this week. I really appreciate it. Please like and subscribe. Leave a comment. Tell me which horse I should buy before the end of the festival. Only the old horses though. The 40% off ones. I'm not buying any more new horses. Let me know. I'll see you guys next week for the new dressage. I hope you're enjoying the festival. I hope you're loving it. I hope you're getting everything you need out of it. Don't forget to go farm your light. It's the easiest way to get your big shillings right now. So yeah, see you guys next week. Bye-bye.